This is one of my favorite modules to talk about because quite frankly most people don't understand how simple it is for Adobe Acrobat to make all of your PDF files searchable. What if every single document that you have, every PDF you use, was searchable? Every patent, every medical record, every deposition. Even further, what if you could search across folders full of documents to find information? But before we start this section, I want to explain a little bit about what OCR actually means and the process of scanning. OCR stands for Optical Character Recognition. Whenever you scan a document in, it's really no different than if you took your smartphone out and you took a picture of that document that's sitting on your desk. Now you know that if you opened up that picture, you couldn't type in the search box and try to find a word within that picture. They're really just little bits and bytes on pieces of paper, each one a little bitty pixel of gray, white, or black. What OCRing does, or Optical Character Recognition does, is it runs this picture through a filter and it estimates what it sees and it returns back a searchable PDF document. Now it's not 100% but 99% is better than nothing so it's, it's a great great tool in your arsenal when you're working with PDFs. OCRing documents in Adobe Acrobat is really not that complicated, but the first thing you have to do is find out whether or not your document is already OCR'd. And you can do that by typing in a word that clearly should come up in the search field and seeing what happens. Well, this document can't find that, so we know this is a, a problem here. And the other thing you can do is go to your View Toolbars Advanced Editing Toolbar and pull up the Text Edit Tool. Now when I click on this document, I should be able to highlight some of this text if it has been OCR'd and, and that's not the case here. But stick with me, we're about to change all that. The OCR process is very straightforward with Adobe Acrobat. Just go to the Documents tab and scroll down to the OCR Text Recognition, then Recognize Text Using OCR. And when you do that, you get this pop-up box and you have some selections to make here. You can OCR the entire document, you can OCR just the page you're on, or just a selection of pages. And I'll just go ahead and pick from one to two for time's sake in this demo. Now, you can also work with the settings here by hitting this edit box, but really the default settings have always worked for me. If you have a particularly difficult document, you might want to play around with those, but try this first and see what happens. So I'll hit OK, and the first thing that happens is, Acrobat goes through and straightens your document out, which is really great. If you have a very crooked document, it's a quick way to straighten it out. Then the next thing that happens is it's gone through and it's done all the OCRing. Now let's go ahead and see if it worked. So now when I type in United, it is indeed finding all the instances of United in this document, or all the instances that are readable or legible. And I can also click on my little text edit tool and see that, yes, indeed, I can come in and I can select this text. Anything I can select, I can copy and paste also. It's even gone through and tried to decipher what this stamp is. So it's not going to be 100%. It probably won't read that as August 31, 1998, but it's going to be pretty darn close. 